Yaani nimebaki tu na moja. Pesa yote yenye niliuza jana imebidi nipeane rent. Aki Paulina ananifanyia maajabu hapa. Atazaji kufukuza atanje hapa. Hmm? Hata mimi naona tuko hii nyumba hata mimi sitaka. Mefia tukani. kitu nimekuleta hapa na utoke hapa. Ni ndio watu wenye mnanichekelea kwa sababu tanja amefukuzwa na Paulina. Hey, jamani. Who can be so insane as to make fun of you? Atanja alikuwa boy mpoa. We all miss him. <laughs> si basi uonge na Paulina amrudishe. Mimi nakwambia atafanya tena makosa. Hata leta shida. Hmm. Shida tu ni Paulina alipendi. Akifuata chance ya kunifukuza mimi, atafurahi sana. Wa Sasa, wewe unajua tu Tanja alikuwa ananisaidia sana hapa. Hmm? Na tulikuwa tunafanya hii biashara. Mimi nikawaacha kwa sababu tusikuwa tuna tunashinda na shindana. Lakini sasa ameenda itabidi tu mimi nianze tena kufanya hii kazi. Unajua hii kazi inaleta pesa nyingi kushinda kulimalimu huko kwa shamalimu. Nene idea poa. Lakini shida ni moja. Hata sina pesa ya kuongeza kwa hii biashara. Hmm? Na mimi sitaki kunyang'anya mtu. Na mimi sitaki kuiba. Na ndo nilikuwa na kuja kukuomba loan. Hata mimi niko na mashida sina hata ndururu. <laughs> na si uende kwa hiyo hiyo mwanaume wenyu mwenye mnangangania na sandi ya kupatelo. Wewe abufu kuna kwa na ujinga mingi saa nyingine. I don't want to talk, okay? I'm in no mood. Um, it's very early in the morning. And uh I was told that you went to you went to Naivasha for a holiday with Ray. I don't want to talk about it. Please. Come on. What are friends for? We are housemates and we should only stick out for each other. I wish Ray saw it the same way too, but unfortunately he's so egocentric. Insensitive and reliable, he's such a pig. You sound bitter. Why should I not be bitter, Andy? Why? Tell me, who goes for holidays with two women? Take them to the same hotel. But the only difference is he puts them in different hotel rooms. Seriously. Wait, I'm I, I'm not getting the click. Which women? What bedrooms? Um, who it is? Who? Um, who is it? The last time Tess was here, we had a. A, a, a little bit of drama with Tess and Prince. So Tess and I, we ended up in Ray's car and he took us both to Naivasha. What? Yes. Holy creep. And yesterday, he kicked Tess out. Today it was me. But, but why? He said that he wanted time alone to clear his head, that he wanted to think. Did you sleep with them together. No, none of us did. He slept on the couch throughout. Yeah? Who does that? Who kicks out a lady early in the morning? <sighs> no wonder Tess wants to wants to seek revenge. Tess? Um look, I've got something very important to tell you. Ugh. 
Damn, Rashi, pick up my call. Hello. Yeah. Morning, Rashi. Uh, hello, friends. How are you? I'm good. Our business deal is still on. I hope you haven't forgotten about it. No, it has not. I had to pass by the office to sort some stuff. I called the lady in your office too to join us. And you did what? I think she's a resourceful girl. She can make a good lawyer. I think it is good if we begin with two brilliant lawyers. Turn the balance into consideration. I am not so certain about her. Yes. No, I am not comfortable with the arrangement. Well, you just have to be tolerant. But she's in Naivasha with her boyfriend. I don't think so. What do you mean by that? to ask you about the rent. When are you going to pay? It's 14k as usual. <laughs> when you came in, you said you'd pay for two rooms. You as a princess. No! I don't care whether Amanda and Cecily share the same room as princess. We made a deal and I'll stick to it. You can reclaim your money from them like you've always done. Do I look like I care whether they are going to refund the money to you or not? You and Andy brought them here. They are your girlfriends, not mine. You just send me the money, okay? No, oh, this man thinks he can joke around with my rent. What is it? Um, okay, I'm hosting Prince, Tess, and a businesswoman called Rashi. What? Are you out of your mind, Andy? Shh. Um, it's about, it's about, it's a business entity. <laughs> you guys, you must be high on something illegal. Holy Jesus. Look, Ray has gone bonkers. He's hurting everyone around him. Others need money <laughs> to move on. We need to grow. Ah, uh, this is too much. Does he know? Um, no, he doesn't know. But um, as soon as we, every, uh, as soon as everything is in place, we shall jointly tell him. Ah, oh, my goodness! This is the most outrageous conspiracy I've ever witnessed in my whole entire life. We want you to be a part of it. Who me? Yeah. <laughs> Andy, listen, I'm a cop, and I love my job. And besides, I still love Ray. I can't <laughs> hurt him. Uh, after making a fool out of you. That's just temporary, okay? You guys go ahead with your meeting or whatever you call it, but I will not be part of it. Okay, then promise me that you won't tell him prematurely. That's none of my business, Andy. Besides, I don't know how you guys came out with this crazy idea, but I don't want to be part of it, okay? Even though I'll shut my mouth and I'll shut it because I don't want to get involved. Later. Prince? Prince, 
Hello, are you still there? Yeah, I'm here. Are you okay? Is everything fine? Yes, I'm fine. You sound distracted. No, no, I'm fine. My car has mechanical problems, so you and Tess when she comes for work. No, she's already here. Oh, good. Come to town. We shall go for car hire and drive to Andy's place. Do you still think it is a good idea to have the meeting at Ray's place? Andy is part of the business idea, and right now we are going under the invitation of Andy, not Ray. So erase all, all things to do with Ray from your mind. All right, I will. I will have to hang up. See you in a while. See you in a while. Jeez. I said hi to you and your mommy, but you weren't What are you doing here? I'm going to work. Now ask a question. What are you doing here, you little devil? I've come to work as usual. How will I get the money I'm looking for? What if I speak with Paulina about it? Can she help me? She's very difficult to understand. And that woman operates entirely on her mood. Wait. Her food must be good because it's end month and it just paid her. I know, I know, I know. It's early in the morning and here I am, coming back in the house, looking so haggard, worn out like a punctured food. Hey, doctor, doctor, come in, how are you? Tell me all about it. You guys are back? Yeah. No, I'm back, but Ray is back yet. How is that possible? I thought the two of you went together. No, he said uh, he kicked me out today, early in the morning, saying that he needed serious time alone to think. Can you imagine? Jesus, Ray! Yeah, Ray. Huh. Okay, enough with me. How's your issue with Andy? I tell you, I think we've blended perfectly into this house. Again. Really? Hi. Remember that guy wanted to get to kidnap those Indian kids? Oti? Hey, Oti. Imagine he came back. No. He tied me, Lois, Sammy, Sandy. Imagine in the bathroom. No. We're all tied up. Just imagine struggling to get out. <laughs> Thank God Andy saved the day. Eh, really? <laughs> <laughs> so I guess you guys are back together then. Sandy's still in the picture. Oh, yeah, but there's something I need to do, mm -hmm. but then I'll be back and then you can catch up. Okay, okay, sure. Yeah. You come for You don't work here anymore. Your internship ended a week ago. We don't have any more vacancies here. But Irene has not yet been replaced ever since you conspired to kick out of this farm. Are you not part of the conspiracy? You is that why you betrayed me to Ray? I just had to find a means to survive. That's it. But you're with him in Naivasha. <sighs> he kicked me out at seven years. What? <laughs> seven years in the morning? It's, it's not funny. <laughs> at least show some sympathy. He kicked me out at 7 a.m. in the morning, like a harlot coming from a client's house. 
I didn't even get time to dress up or even do my hair. After you even gave him all the fundamentals, eh? He didn't get anything. He slept on the couch. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!